Alright. We're back. Solitude. Uh, these guys gotta check in. I don't know. Alright, you know, maybe. Yeah. Well, Hello, friend. I got a bunch of divines. All right. Oh, thank you. All right. Yeah, we got divines. It. Bless your kind heart. All right. Here you go, buddy. Always good talking right, to yeah, you. Yeah, the executioner here. Uh, he's got to come back and check in. We've been out on the road for a while. Uh, Bell Rand. I don't know. He wanted to come back. I don't know why. He, he just probably wants to go drinking because he just looks looks sits in the bar looking for a job and. Well, he's got a job with us, so. Right. Speaking of gold, let's cash Seems out. There's this no stuff. end to the needs of the Imperial. Right. Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. He makes all the armor for the whole army or something. I don't know. Don't ask me how he does that, but. Alright. He ain't got nothing good. He just has the basics. Get some iron. Make some, make some more stuff. I like that banging on the metal all day. This guy's got it good. By the forge. I mean, I like getting fresh air, adventuring, but I don't know. this guy's got it good. Return anytime you need arms. Well, not this arms. guy. He's got to do it for My the whole army, but <laughs> the, most of these guys, <laughs> you know. Most of them are Nothing like the smell of a white hot flame. Look at all the stuff you can make here. He's got a lot of blueprints. Oh, what the? The mushroom freaking houses. You can carve mountains. You can make a freaking mountain in this I've forge. Got weapons for giving, armor oh, that's for scary. Hey, Belran, you want to live in this? He likes that weird stuff. <laughs> all right. Mm. Whoa, what? Catapult. Like, that could come in handy. <laughs> Alright, yeah, he's got the real stuff here. Mushrooms, what the heck? We could really spruce up that uh, campsite there. What do you say, Belran? Alright. Uh, I don't even have enough stuff to make any of that. Bone mold, wow. That's pretty cool. You can't catch me wearing that, but uh, <laughs> you ain't gonna get hurt too hard wearing that stuff. You know, of course, you can barely move in it, but. All right. Yeah, we picked up some tips on the road uh, how to forge better, so that's why I'm checking in all these recipes, learning some stuff. Look at that treasure chest. Arms and armor. We got a ton of treasure. All right. Well, that's weird. Never ending a list of <laughs> items here. <laughs> Stables. You can build everything you can build. You can come here, map it out, and uh, they'll give you the supplies for it, I guess. This guy's big industrial uh, provider for this area, huh? It's the big stuff. I've got weapons for given and uh, armor weapons. for getting. Weapons and armor. You got a whole houses and mountain ranges here, guy. <laughs> I mean, come on, don't sell yourself short there, guy. Jeez, this guy, he's got nothing to do. Go have a drink or something, guy. I mean, you don't need to follow me up here. The divine saved me from the streets. All right. And they can save you from your trials as well. Well, maybe. I don't know. I don't like any of that weird stuff. Divines are good weird, I guess, supposedly. I don't know. I never hear anyone say anything bad about them. That lady seems pretty sweet, right? But, uh, who the heck knows? You're blessing, they're blessing sure you to do. I don't even know what. I did take the one blessing for the warrior, though, but I didn't notice any change. I mean, come on. You either kill them or they kill Welcome you, right? Welcome to the center of the world, huh. or at least my brother. Right. Some might call this junk. Nobody cares Maybe. about Eric except I you. I call them treasures. All right. I don't even know what the heck she's talking about all the time. I think I'd seen him somewhere, but didn't make much of an impression on me. Uh, not as much as you complaining about him, did? All right. And this is the uh, the blacksmith's wife right here, so she's got a lot of good stuff too. These guys got the monopoly on supplies in this town, you know. Family business, right? All right. All right. 
I gotta grab some more potions here, man. It's rough out there. Alright, oh, look at that. Some nice backpacks. Alright, I think our husband makes this stuff. Or maybe someone just brought it in. Garbage. Alright, what do we got? Do we even have anything to sell? I sold us some stuff that was Khajiit outside before I came in. I think they took all the good stuff. Yeah, what are we... To bits and pieces anytime. Right, what are we even doing here? Guys, come on. Why don't you remind me I sold all my stuff already? Alright. Probably could have gotten rid of a few of those things, but it ain't worth it. Alright. Well. Guys, we have a mission actually nearby here, so I, I didn't feel like doing that, but we might have to do that. Because we don't have enough stuff now to sell. I'd be uh, a lot warmer and I a lot happier gold, with a belly full of meat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, the tavern's over there, guy. Take a break, right? I'm not playing with you, Kai. I'm playing with you. Arms and armor. Forged by a master craftsman. All right. What can we make here? Well, we don't need that. Man, there's so many varieties of cloaks you can make. I made this cloak, man. It took me a while to learn how to make this thing. Making cloaks is not as easy as you think. You don't just slap a bear on the back of your <laughs> neck, you know what I mean? You gotta cut that thing right so it ain't ragged on the edges. You gotta make it fit so it don't fall off. You gotta make it so it's not too heavy, but uh, just heavy enough, you know? It ain't easy. It took me a while to learn how to do that. And this is not the best cloak, but I think it looks pretty good, you know? Feels nice. And I got I learned how to keep the claws on it there. You see you gotta put the little button in there, the little strap. I mean this is some delicate freaking work here. You wouldn't even expect it, you know? But uh, I don't know. I think it looks pretty good, right? I mean you know I'm out there slaying stuff when I walk around with this thing, right? And plus it keeps me warm and it don't keep me too hot. I got the short sleeve on, you know, a day like today. It's pretty nice out. Bad. Wanderer like you must have plenty of tales to tell. Oh, yeah. But I'm afraid I'm too busy to hear them. Well, I ain't much for talking, I guess. I guess I talked to you guys a little bit, but all right. How the, who the heck does this guy's hair, by the way? I mean, that's a nice hair job. I mean, how's to get to do that? I ain't never seen a barber in this town. All right, man. Look at this crew. This is a motley looking crew, by the way. I mean, you see us walking through town, I don't know. I mean, you know we could kick your butt, but a little weird looking here. Especially Belran back there. I don't know about that guy. Alright, I mean, he's a good guy and all, but I don't know. He likes spirits, and we're not talking about the uh, alcoholic variety, you know what I mean? He's always, like, uh, conjuring out. His best buddy is this wolf that's made out of... Lightning? I don't even freaking know what the... I don't know how that works. Always in the way, though. I mean, it does help, I guess. Sometimes, maybe. I don't know. All right, guys. Uh, there's nothing going on here. And uh, he said there's no executions today. So we can come back tomorrow or the next day or whenever. So, uh, I don't know. We're going to go kill some bandits. All right, let's go bash some skulls. All right, let's go... Man, I've been in that city. I like being in the city, but uh, not too much going on there. I, I could stand for some slower pace, you know, but uh, idle hands, you know. Not too much to do with the forge there either right now. But uh, that guy's too busy to teach me anything. Like in the other towns, they were showing me how to do some stuff, you know. All right, guys, you ready for one more adventure? I don't even know. This could be our last adventure here because I know he's got a lot of uh, prisoners there that are waiting to get killed, you know? <laughs> I can't leave him waiting too long. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know. And Belran... Like me, eh? I don't know. Don't fancy those clunky two-handed weapons. Yeah, you're right, man. I, I like the sword and the board mostly. Uh, at least just one sword. You got to keep the other hand free to block or, you know, grab their neck or whatever. You know what I mean? <laughs> All right, I think we gotta swing down this way to get here. This place along the coast, they got bandits along the coast, robbing ships. Good place to set up pirates, you know. They're not pirates on the open sea, but pirates that, you know, when they're coming into the dock, they get them, get them good there. All right, there's, 
That's what I'm talking about. Right down the road here. Right before they get to this harbor. They're getting pillaged, you know. So the Yarl has a bounty out on these. There's the Yarl's palace right there. Speaking of Yarl, look at that. Man, they built this thing on that rock. They're like, they see that rock. They're like, all right, that's where we're putting the palace. Uh, we can put the rest of it over there. <laughs> they got the good place, the good location, right? Because, man, try attacking that thing. That ain't easy. You got to go through the whole town. You ain't climbing up those rocks anytime soon, right? Except I hear they got dragons and stuff, so I don't know about that. They could probably get there pretty easily, but uh, I ain't seen any dragons yet. Just a rumor that there's dragons about Helgen or somewhere. I don't know. So, uh, we were pretty near that. We were at Fall Creek. That's right. We basically passed right by Helgen. I ain't seen no dragons up in the sky, <laughs> you know? So maybe it's nesting or... Maybe someone killed the dragon and there ain't no dragons no more, or maybe, uh, I don't know. Alright, pretty nice day out. Usually kind of cold, I mean it is kind of cold out here, I can see my breath, but the sun, you don't even notice the cold at all. Alright, let's get the shield out here, man, there's something bad on the road. This is going to be some wild beast. Something's happening here. There's all these weird wild creatures. They look like combinations of two or three different creatures. I don't know what they're doing out there. They're getting busy, uh, you know, like ways nature never quite intended to get busy. You know what I mean? All right. Well, ain't much going on out here today, though. That's for sure. We got like the triple pitter patter on our footsteps here, <laughs> running in rhythm. Pretty cool, uh, pretty cool beat we got going here. All right, down here. All right, oh, this is this lighthouse. Oh man. All right, I remember that. All right, this guy. This yeah. Let's check the the map here. That lizard in town was like, I got a job for you. This guy's the shadiest guy in town. He's like, put out the light. This is what I was saying. Put out the light. There's a grotto. They must be working with these guys or something. Or maybe they're rivals. He's like, put out the fire. And so at night, the ship is going to crash. And then we'll rescue the ship uh, and uh, maybe take a few of their crates and uh, maybe kill the guys too, probably. This is this guy's plan. He needs me to come here and shut the light out. So, uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll help him and turn the tables on him. But I don't really want to be pillaging no uh, random ships, you know? Maybe you have like some, uh, you know, fellow bandit ship or something, <laughs> you know. I would do it, but I don't know. Let's check it out though. That's it. Guys, come on. You know, I'd be doing this and my buddy here is gonna have my head, you know what I mean? Not that he's the judge or the jury, but he is the executioner, you know what I'm saying? So uh, <laughs> we'll be there before long. Doing schemes like this, man. That ain't gonna work. Look at that. He's got his axe ready right there. You know what I'm saying? All right. Well, I don't know. I like doing a good double cross, though, so I'm thinking about it, you know? Put the light out. Maybe we can warn him somehow. Divert him. Get, get the guy. I don't know. There's always a way. All right. What do we got here? Another grotto. Well, this is probably where the guy. This is probably where the guy hides out that we're talking about. The lizard guy. All right, we're gonna take his stuff right here. Looks like his little stash. Whoa, that's a weird freaking. We're selling that. Mind fog. What the heck? I read that thing. All of a sudden, everyone's mind's cloudy. How the heck does that even work? It doesn't even make sense. All right, I guess we gotta go this way. Uh, rocky terrain. All right. Well. Yeah, you can't even look at this map. All right. Uh, all right. Ah, uh, we can go down here. Yeah. All right, we can jump. All right, not that far. All right, come on, guys. Uh, are they even following me? <laughs> I don't even know. Oh, they're afraid to jump. Look at this. They'd rather get wet than jump, these guys. <laughs> it ain't that far, guys. Come on. I didn't even get hurt. Well, I ain't been here in a while. The coast. All right. 
nice day out. Look at that. Look at that sky. Wow. Alright, where the heck is this place? It's down around that corner. I think around on the other side of that rock. Right over there. Right up there, I bet. Alright, we gotta clear out some bandits. This is gonna be fun. This is my idea of fun. Taking a couple of the boys. Getting rough. Smacking a few heads around. Maybe having a few brews afterwards. That's what I call a good day. So it's already starting off pretty good. Can we get up here? Oh my god. All right. Cut through this way instead of going around, I guess. Oh my god, this ledge. All right. Uh, this is tough. These guys aren't going to make that. Uh, I guess we're going the long way. Mm -hmm. All right. Well. Gonna get wet. I try not to get wet. We're gonna get just our boots. Oh, it's nice. pretty shallow there. Alright, get on the land. Alright, we're alright. Uh, oh, okay. Horker. Whoa, that scared me. They ain't too rough. Alright, well. Alright, guys, you're here. Thank God. Oh, I splashed. I turned around to see if they're there and I got all splashed. <laughs> I'm just too excited. Alright. Guys, let's go kick some butt. All right, well, uh, that's the cave right there. All right. We're going to take in the sun for a minute. Enjoy the day before we go into a dark, bloody, <laughs> soon-to-be bloody cave. All right, we'll do that next time. I'm just going to enjoy this for a little while. Thanks for listening.